We have gathered all the forces we can. Darkspawn Horde is sure to reach the capital before us. And so we must race to Denerim as quickly as we can. The lives of many thousands hang in the balance. We must not forsake them. You have gathered an army to replace the one lost at Ostagar, Grey Warden. Let us pray that it will be enough. Before us stands the might of the Darkspawn Horde. Gaze upon them now, but fear them not. This man beside me is a native of Ferelden, now risen to the ranks of the Grey Wardens. He is proof that glory is within reach of us all. He has survived despite the odds, and without him, none of us would be here. Today, we save Denerim. Today, we avenge the death of my husband, your King Caelan! But most of all, today we show the Grey Wardens that we remember and honor their sacrifice! For Ferelden! For the Grey Wardens! Okay, we are fighting the dark spawn. We have gotten into Denerum and discovered that bitch is under siege. What? We're gonna do it. I thought he was Well, I notice that all of our characters appear to be here, and though none of them are actually in our party, which makes this assault into here slightly less suicidal. <laughs> Start killing some things. Now the blight isn't going to end, even if we destroy this dark spawn army. Until we destroy the until we destroy the Archdeep. This guy's a way under level 20. Even if we do destroy the army, they're just going to retreat underground and the dark spawn are going to breed more and more. As opposed to um, humans, which will much more slowly reproduce their population. So it's really best in our, in our best interest to kill the demon, uh, arch demon as quickly as possible. Uh, there's a lot of friggin' things to kill out here. 
finally getting more chance to kill some dark spawn though. You gotta love it. There is no glory in some guy. <laughs> yeah, the thing that all this was endangered because Loghain betrayed Merrick. Now I, I don't know if the Archdemon would have arrived at that battle for us to have a chance to destroy it. But by destroying the by, by allowing Caitlyn's army to be destroyed, Logan basically endangered all of Ferelden because, and basically the entire world, because he plunged the entire country into civil war when it really couldn't afford it. it should have been focusing on impending dark spawn, the rays of light, and all of that. Now, in a certain respect, you have to think that maybe not everything that Logan did was that shit crazy. He legitimately did believe that he was doing the best thing for Elden. It does thing for for Elden by going and killing the king and all that kind of crap. Right. Oh, just one of these things had money. Yes, because I need that at this point. You've managed to fight your way to the gates. We're doing better than I hoped. That will change quickly. Bloody Nug Runners are outnumbered three to one. What are we to do now, Riordan? You have a plan, I assume? The army will not last long, so we need to move quickly to reach the Archdemon. I suggest taking Alistair and no more than two others with you into the city. Anyone you don't bring with you can remain here to prevent more Darkspawn from entering Denerim on our tails. Why so small a group? A large group is only going to draw attention, and I think I know what we need to do. We're going to need to reach a high point in the city. I'm thinking the top of Fort Draken might work. The top of... you want to draw the dragon's attention? We have little choice, though I warn you that as soon as we engage the beast, it will call all its generals to help it. I can sense two generals in Denerim. You may wish to seek them out before going to Fort Draken. I am sure that if we did slay those generals, it would stop the Darkspawn in the city from doing a lot of harm. It may also waste resources trying to find them. The decision is up to you. Do you know where these generals are? Neither of them are near Fort Draken currently. But there are too many Darkspawn here to tell you more. There are already several units of our allies within the city by now. They may be able to come to your assistance if you call them. Their strength will be limited. Now, who do you wish to take with you into the city? Well, I'm gonna need a mage for healing. And I'll take a rogue. I'm also gonna bring yes. Alistair because he's involved in the story. Fair enough. Anyone else will need to remain here and assist in keeping more Darkspawn from coming in the gates behind us. Who will lead them? Sten would be suitable. Very likely. Good. That should be sufficient. Nothing you have done has prepared you for what you face now. May the Maker watch over you. Well, this is it, Warden. When from the blood of battle the stone is fed, let the heroes prevail and the blighters lie dead. <laughs> As one of the blighters, I sodding salute you. Let's show them our hearts, and then show them theirs. Are you ready? We have reached the battlefield at last. This is it. The Arishok asked, what is the Blight? I stand here looking into its eyes, and still I have no answer for him. But perhaps... You do. You have carried us this far. Do not doubt that. So this is it? This is the end? We've come so far. It's strange knowing that all our fates will be decided in a matter of hours. We stand on the precipice before the greatest battle of our age. I wonder if the heroes of old ever felt like this. Probably. I am not afraid. We go to fight for a good cause, and there is nowhere else I would rather be. You are a dear, dear friend, 
and I will stand with you to whatever end. This day, we will forge a legend of our own. Heading off to slay dragons without me, hmm? Fine, fine. Say hello to the Archdemon for me. He never writes anymore. It's rather distressing. And do watch your back. No getting eaten, unless you think it's really important, of course. So we head into the city together, as it should be. Once this is done, no matter how it turns out, I will be gone. You are aware of this, yes? And if I die? Then I would mourn the passing of a friend. <sighs> Allow me to say only one thing before we go. I knew nothing of friendship before we met. And I will always consider you such. Live well, my friend. Live gloriously. Now, let us see this finally done. The Archdemon awaits. Before we head after the Archdemon, I want to say something. I know Morrigan's... What she did is supposed to save us, but who knows if she can be trusted? Or if we'll even survive long enough to take that final blow. So I just want you to know that it's been an honor fighting by your side. Well, I'm guessing somebody told you then. <laughs> to the honor of the Grey Wardens. To the honor of the Grey Wardens. Watch over you! 